Hello YouTube, today I'm going to show you how to SSH your iPod, iPod Touch, or iPad, pretty much any iDevice you have, via CyberDucky. If you don't know what CyberDucky is, I will show you right now. CyberDucky is an FTP, uh, PTPS, FTP programming program, basically a file transfer program. So it was sort of like, um, uh, I can't remember the name, but you know. This is CyberDuck. It's an open source FTP, SFTP, and web dev and web cloud program. Basically, you can access server files and stuff like that. If you have like a gaming server, you know, Counter Strike Source, Leopard Ed, stuff like that. And uh, you just go to cyberducky.ch and go to whatever, oh, download panel right here. You have Windows and Mac or Linux, whatever you decide to call it. So after you've done that, you're going to want to have a jailbroken iPod. As you can see, mine's jailbroken. Well, you can't really tell, but now you can. And you're going to want to go to Cydia. Open city up. Then you're gonna want to go and search for an app called Screen Splitter. Once this is done loading, wow, that's some uh, major lag. There you go. As you can see right there, Screen Splitter. It says it right on the board, right there. On um. On there. Then you're going to want to, once you have that, you're going to want to go to your home page, your home menu. My home button is so messed up. There we go. You want to go to wherever you put it and just tap it to turn it on. As you can see, I turned it off by accident. And once you've once you've um, turned it on, it will say on your iPod accept connection from so and so, and then you'll be on your iPod. Once you've done this, go to your settings, which you, which is comes with every iPod. It's in the OS. And you want to go to your Wi-Fi. You have to have Wi-Fi for this wireless internet. And click this uh, little button there. Click the little um, blue button arrow right there. And once you've done that, it will show your IP. For right now, I have my IP. As you can see, I'm on my iPod right now. Let's uh, go back out. And then once you have CyberDucky installed, go to Open Connection, SFTP, SSH File Transfer Protocol. Click that. Type in your IP and in your username. Type root. Uh, lowercase Alpine. No, no um uppercase. Everything's no uppercase or lowercase. Just no oh, wait. No uppercase letters, just like how you've seen it. Put in Alpine as a password, root as the username, the port is 22, and your IP is your IP. And this will pop up. Click always, unless you're using it on someone else's iPod, you have them out or something. In that case, unclick it. But this is my iPod, so I'll hit allow. And once you're in here, once you've this has popped up, go to then you're in your iPod. Whatever you need to do, you can do. If you know what you're doing, I wouldn't delete. Just go willy-nilly deleting everything, which I'm not going to do, because that will be really, really stupid. This will destroy your iPod. You will probably have to restore it. If you can't restore it, you will have to, you know. So, yeah. You can uh, do whatever. Just do if you want something specific. You want to do, like, add a uh, theme or a... Yeah. 
a ringtone, something like that. Go ahead. Till next time, comment, rate, subscribe.